The past two years has been hell for me. I have tried all what I could to see how we fix our marriage. It is not working. Therefore, JJ Six Skill has called off their marriage. My correct and beautiful people, it is no longer news that Funke Akindele, popularly known as Jennifer, and her husband, Abdul Bello, popularly known as JJ Six Skills, marriage has hit a very mighty rock. My correct and lovely people, in this video, we are going to take a look at what led to that marriage to hit a very mighty rock, a very strong rock, and also people's contributions towards it. But before we do that, guys, please permit us to a very big congratulations to Funke Akindele, popularly known as Jennifer, for her nomination as PDP deputy for Lagos governorship candidate. Funke Akindele has been listed among others as PDP deputy governorship candidate in Lagos State. I come in peace and not in pieces. Mom, baby, fought for me. You fought for the future of your children. Yes. 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 Corrupt son. You look by you too. Baby, I'm Jennifer Wale. Corrupt son, we end. Before the husband actually announced the end of their marriage, this is how the young man started by writing some of the posts on his official Instagram page. I read, the only people who are mad at you for speaking the truth are those people who are living a lie. Keep speaking the truth. Staying quiet to keep the peace can be a good thing. But if the peace has already been disturbed, staying quiet won't make anything better. Summon your courage and speak up when you feel the need to. I will be okay just not today and probably not tomorrow. Whatever you do, please don't shrink yourself to resist change. Please don't let the weight of other people hold you down to the point where you are unable to move forward at all. Listen to your heart. Open up your mind and dance freely to where you know in your heart you need to be. Every new beginning comes from some other beginning's end. I am bent but not broken. I am scared but not disfigured. I am sad but not hopeless. I am tired but not lifeless. I am afraid but not powerless. I am angry but not bitter. I am depressed but not giving up. After making all these parables, Abdul Bello, popularly known as JJC Skills, finally opened up what is happening in their marriage. He finally hit the nail by the head and announced breakup in the marriage as follows. Dear friends and family, I need to let you know that Funke and I have separated. While it lasted, we shared a lot of things together and have created two beautiful children. The last two years have been extremely difficult for us. I know I have tried my best to fix things, but I believe it is beyond repairs now. Three months ago, and at Funke's insistence, I moved out of the house and apart from AMVCA, have not been able to get Funke to sit down in an amicably manner to discuss the future of our relationship. I am making this announcement so that the public is clear that we both are pursuing separate lives. We still have issues that need to be addressed such as the custody and well-being of our children which is paramount as well as business interests which need to be disentangled. But I have no doubt that this will be resolved one way or the other. Mr. Abdul Bello My correct and beautiful people, this is how Mr. Abdul Bello popularly known as JJC Skills, finally break up, finally announced the end of his marriage with a popular Nigerian actress, Funke Akindele, widely known as Jennifer. This marriage has been a role model. It has been a marriage that everybody was like, ah, for Funke and uh, JJC Skills, they are trying, mm -hmm. they are doing wonderfully well. Some people even use them as a case study. I know how many people have said good about them. I know how many people have used them as a case study. The two are working together. They are making sure their business moves. I am not saying this for the purpose of this video. I am saying it because I have some witness who have said it on my face that Funke Akindele and her husband are doing great. They love their union. They love their marriage. They are running their business together, trying to make sure two of them grows together. In fact, it has been like, you know what I am trying to say. But today, look at where it has ended. Look at the story we are hearing. Look at how it is. 
does it mean people shouldn't trust any celebrity marriage? Does it mean celebrities cannot marry? Does it mean marriage is not worth it again? What are we turning marriage into? Is a question I'm asking. If you have an answer to this question, please do well to put it on the comment section. Why are they making marriage look so fearful? Why are they making it look as if it is not achievable? Well, that is for those that want to believe it that way. For me, I know marriage is achievable. I know marriage is successful. And I know my own marriage is going to be successful. And I know your own, my followers, you guys that are watching my video, your marriage must be successful. In Jesus' name, amen. This has caused a lot of reactions on social media. Please guys, let us consider some as we move on. According to a politician and real estate mogul, Baba Tunde said, Breakfast is served. Lunch is coming. Dinner will be sumptuous. Baba Tunde Badamosi has taken to social media to throw shit at actress Funke Akindele after news of her marital crisis surfaced on social media. On why Badamosi would be threatening the actress, many believe this is largely due to Akindele's taking sides with his ex wife Shade, who kicked him out after impregnating another woman. This person also wrote Funke Akindele marriage has crashed. Marriage is not for two males. As a woman, if you hustle too much, you become a male in spirit, body, and soul. I know Kuku talks say, make she no hustle. Don't hustle too much. According to Blessing CEO, the relationship therapist, she said, as usual, they put the blame. You say never marry a woman who has made it. Yet, you men say you want independent woman. Respect has nothing to do with well, it is an inbuilt character and reciprocal too. You said never marry a social media freak, but you men want to benefit and enjoy same privilege. I have said it so many times. She is not what you all think she is. I lived with her for two years. It was horror. Jajesi's skilled son blasts her stepmom Funke Akindeli. My correct people, we also have other contributions that affect this marriage breakup. This marriage that has just crashed, people are not happy at all. Let us also consider what our social media in-laws and judges are talking about this particular issue. As this one said, I hate to see marriages break. Even if every marriage break for this world, I go still marry. Oh, nothing you won't tell me with laugh emoji. Hey guys, don't allow all this scare you from getting married. Gather here if you still do much belief in marriage. And the second writer here said, I will get married and my marriage will work in Jesus' name. While the other writer here also wrote, You all can't scare me. My own marriage will work. Amen. This writer said, I really don't understand why you guys think we need to know this. While the other writer here also wrote, Jesus, Jesus lover said it. This writer said, this oh pain me gani, I love them together, marriage, it takes a lot. Two forgiving partners, two people determined to make it work. No one perfect, but with godly fear and love, we make our home heaven on earth. It is a decision we made before entering into marriage. This always cautions me. I remember my resolution to make this work, and it's been awesome. It keeps my emotion in check. People, your own marriage will work in Jesus' name. And this writer said, this is sad with love emoji. While the other one here said, A.Y. Kubi. And the other writer here also wrote, if you want your marriage and relationship to last, please keep it off social media. Please read that again. This writer wrote, I see why your son runs to Instagram. He learned from you. If it brings you peace at Funke, Jennifer Akindele, please let it go. Both father and son toxicity isn't something I would like for you. My correct and beautiful people, if you are not married yet, please don't be scared of marriage. If you have, please make your marriage work. It is possible. It is possible if you believe it will work. At this point, I want to say thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next update that comes your way. Till we meet again, same station. Bye. While waiting for response from Funke Akindele.